The U.S. is on its way to Mars. It was a picture-perfect launch from Cape Canaveral this morning. NASA and United Launch Alliance launched an Atlas V rocket. On board was the Perseverance rover and its helicopter. News 6's James Sparvero was at this morning's historic launch. And we have successful separation of Mars 2020 with the Perseverance rover. United Launch Alliance announcing the in-flight milestone of NASA's $2 billion Perseverance rover mission, now traveling 26,000 miles per hour on its interplanetary journey. The perseverance of humanity launching the next generation of robotic explorers to the red planet. An hour before separation, the Atlas V rocket blasts off at the opening of the 750 launch window. And Mach 1, Atlas V is now supersonic. Flying today keeps Mars 2020 from becoming Mars 2022. NASA only had another two weeks or so until the alignment of Earth and Mars in the solar system would no longer make the mission possible for two more years engine response continues to look good. Instead, it will only be another seven months when Perseverance and its Ingenuity helicopter are expected to become NASA's ninth robotic Martian landing. I think there would be no bigger discovery in the history of humanity than finding life that is not on our own world. We've been on this path of following the water to determine if some place is habitable or not. Now we know that there was, at one point in time, habitability on Mars. And early in this journey, a very long, long distance call. NASA says it acquired a signal with the spacecraft minutes after separation. That lets the team know the rover is headed in the right direction. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero getting results, News 6.